Sinnen erleben und Grenzen verschieben, das ist das Leitmotiv der Biennale des bewegten Bildes. A just opened exhibition in the Central Academy of Fine Arts in Beijing offers a discovery of what technology can do for art. Entitled Moving in Time, B3 plus Beijing, the exhibition merges both the interactive and the interdisciplinary. Über 200 Künstler sind vor Ort, an 20 verschiedenen Orten im Rhein-Main-Gebiet gibt es Ausstellungen. Initiativen wie die B3, Biennale des bewegten Bildes, sorgen dafür, dass wir zusätzlich attraktiv sind für die kreativsten Köpfe aus Europa. Wir haben Virtual Reality Elemente, wo man dann sozusagen immersive, allumgebende Bildwelten erlebt. Wir haben die Games, wir haben die interaktiven neuen Bildwelten. Ich glaube, da passiert sehr viel. You have in, you know, in just this space of this floor so many different points of view sharing the same goal, which is to communicate. And that is amazing. Na Not a reality. I make a dream, yeah. And for me, making it as an artist, it was all about the act of looking. To create a language that resonates with a kind of mysterious experience. So the senses often are being used and transformed in our interactive installations. It is actually the plant that becomes the interface that expands maybe the human sense. The works are dealing very specifically with, with expanded vision and very subconsciously excluding many other senses to create this virtual and in a sense kind of cold and perhaps kind of, I suppose, deathly undercurrent within simulation. I think there'll be a lot of cross-platform uh, merging in the future. I think it'll be exciting. All these lines are getting blurred. It was a, a much wider world than I knew goes on. Inventions that happened earlier are now reaching a, a platform that uh, real people can use them in a different way. It changes the audience too. Signatures of all things I am here to read. Discovering what things we can bring with us into the new medium from the old mediums. In contemporary art, especially in New York, uh, virtual reality and immersion are very much a part of the kind of con contemporary dialogue. So all of these arts, video arts, games, TV, films, they are all dealing with questions of how to engage audience, how to reach them. How do we cross, you know, virtual world, physical world? How do we cross actually boundaries? Well, we'd like the viewer to experience themselves in a different form of selfie. It's all about immersion, I guess. People just want to feel like they're more part of the experience. All of this new digital media, they're going to revolutionize our life. The way that we see things, the way we perceive events, the way we experience everyday life. But I just hope that B3 will 
keep moving people by moving images. It's really inspired me actually because it's, it's given me sort of even more ideas because of the so much artistic freedom around here. Two years from now it will be, who knows? Expanding Senses is the theme of B3 this year and all the artists are pushing boundaries. And there simply is no other event in the world that is like B3. Was für die zeitgenössische Kunst die Dokumenta schafft, vielleicht schaffen wir das mit der B3 für die bewegte Bildkunst. I really wanted to thank everyone in uh, in the room and uh, I'm very happy to be here. Equal award goes to Eve Nethammer's opus. The award that expanded senses is awarded to John Gerard. And the Emerging Talent Award goes to Kate Cooper. We're approaching the final of the final of the B3 Biennale, the Lifetime Achievement Award. Yeah, whatever I'm going to say about Brian and his work, my words will never come close to adequately describe the quality of Brian's creations. I'm interested in producing people when they're doing something different. And now, please welcome on stage Brian Eno for the Lifetime Achievement Ben. Welcome. It's lovely to be in Frankfurt. I've been here quite a few times in my life. I, I would really like to say thank you to B3. Thank you so much and enjoy the rest of your evening. Thank you. I had a really nice time at B3 and I recommend you come to see it. <laughs>